dudes already know that girls tend to like movies about male strippers, firefighters and football players with hearts of gold. But there are other, less obvious choices that could get ladies in the mood on movie night. With a subtle stroke of his fingers while explaining chaos theory, he hints at the kind of chaos he can cause in the bedroom. Trying to fill Patrick Swayze's shoes is a difficult, if not impossible, task. But Diego Luna gives a whole new generation of ladies the time of their life with scene after scene of hip thrusting action. He may wear eyeliner and hang out with mythical creatures, but David Bowie's Jeff the Goblin King has a maniacal smoothness that's as intoxicating as it is timeless. At the time of its release, any girl on Team Jennifer felt obliged to hate on this cinematic proof of Brangelina's existence, but the steamy tango number, and fight that turns into sex scene are too hot for a gal to hold the grudge. Scales on human flesh action may not be everyone's idea of erotica, but the red-hot tension between Peter Quill and Gamera is palpable enough to light up anybody's orb. Proving that there are few things as sexy as a man who can handle his artillery, Jamie Foxx's smug grin as he prepares to shoot a snowman is a delectable appetizer to the delicious visual that is him deftly spinning shooting and holstering his gun. This indie predecessor of Fifty Shades of Grey is not your mother's romance story. The moment James Spader demands that Maggie Gyllen will bend over his desk and read him a letter, he cements his position as an unlikely sex symbol with a confident bossiness that would make any woman risk a warning from H.R. Proving that sometimes more is more when it comes to on-screen masculine heat. Heath Ledger and Jake Gyllenhaal provide double the cowboy butts to drive the female population nuts.